Okay, on grooming a puppy, doing the face and the feet. Uh, these are the tools that we'll use today. Um, this particular clipper you can get it from the doggy lounge or you might be able to find it online. It comes with an extra battery, a plug for using without the battery if the battery goes dead, and uh, an extra blade. We also have um, the toenail uh, clippers, straight scissors, and a pair of thinners for doing the top of the head. And that's all we're going to use today. The um, little girl that we're using today for our demo is Maya, and she is four months old. So we got this set on a tin blade, and we're going to start on our ears. So I'll start right down here at the base of the curl. So we're going to go straight up. And if this is your first time with a pair of clippers, um, set it on the 9 instead of the 10. And be careful around the curl. You may want to go down on it first. Notice how I'm laying everything over my finger. Inside the ear, you want all these little pieces right there. Your line is from the eye to the lip. And all this comes off. Now when your dog gets older, they tend to get lip fold issues from hair that's left in the lip fold. So you want to take your thumb, put it in the side right there, and clean all that out. Good girl, Maya. And the line that you're going to use, you make like a collar right there. It's not down to the breastbone. Uh, it would be like three spread fingers up. So, hot. Good girl. Somebody's been chewing on something. There we go. The line to stop is right at the base of the eye there. Good girl. Good girl. Okay, and then the top of the head, we don't leave a hat up there. But uh, we use thinning shears. And unfortunately, these were open too wide. You could have used mine. And have a little burr in them, so I'm not going to open them very wide. And 
somebody's coming in from the barn so we get to hear all the dogs bark. When you're using thinners, when you're going up this way, you're actually cutting really short. And if you're going this way, you're blending. So just be careful coming up the sides or you can make a, a line or a hole. So there's our little four month old girl ready to go. And then the next little thing we're going to do is the feet. And we'll make that on another little video entitled Feet.